So many animals are in need of a forever home. Animal shelters can get very crowded, as we know, and some people aren't sure they can handle the responsibility of having a pet. And that's where a pet foster comes in. We're joined today by Allison Eastwood from Foster Fur Kids. We want to welcome her. The site just launched in January, you were telling me, and already it's a success, isn't it? Yeah, well, it's definitely a work in progress. Mm -hmm. You know, we're building sort of a, a community out there, and uh, it's, it's great because you can just punch in your zip code mm -hmm. and find rescues and people in your area so that, you know, you can connect. And what it does is it connects the person to a rescue in their area that may have a dog that you can take home with you and, and foster and whatnot, right? Exactly. So it connects you with rescues and shelters that uh, need, you know, to find fosters or transportation as well. Uh, Transportation is a big part of rescue is uh, transporting dogs and cats out of shelters to get them out of there before, you know, possibly mm -hmm. being euthanized. And I know a lot of people think about getting a pet. They're not sure if they're going to get along with their kids. What's it like to have a pet, walk it in the morning, take it out, feed it? The fostering is a great way to do that. Yeah, isn't it? it's a great way, and you can get very specific on the website as well. You can, you know, punch in whether you want a dog or a cat. I think there's some other pets on there like rabbits. Um, you know how long you can foster. Um, so there's lots of different things to get very specific about what you're capable of doing. Now, on a personal level, I'm, are you an animal lover yourself? Oh, I mean, yeah. what <laughs> made you get this uh, off the ground? Well, I've been doing animal rescue. Um, we have our, our website is eastwoodranch.org, and we do rescue here in Southern California, and mostly dogs and cats, but we have helped with lots of different animals, and um, I've got my own menagerie <laughs> at home. Uh, lots and lots of kids for kids at home so that was um, the fostering website you know kind of was born out of necessity mm -hmm. um, because we felt that we really needed more fosters and and we wanted to inspire people to, to sign up and by pulling one pet out of the foster out of the uh, sh shelter you make room for another one who may exactly need it, right? and it's a complete light I mean it could be the, a matter of life and death because if you know a lot of animals if they're overcrowded and they're possibly you know, on the red list, as we call it, you know, mm -hmm. maybe not going to make it through the day. Just pulling that, that dog or cat out and having a foster can, can save that life. Now, the Eastwood uh, name, very well known here in Hollywood. Would you Is like it? to tell our viewers <laughs> who you're related to? Oh, I'm related to this guy that nobody knows called Clint Eastwood. Clint but, you know. Eastwood, everybody. <laughs> And I'm guessing he's as much a, an animal lover as you he are. He is. He is. They actually, his girlfriend and him just adopted a dog uh, a couple of weeks ago from the SPCA in Monterey. So he's got a bunch of dogs and they've got birds and all sorts of stuff. So. And, and the best thing is if you need a little extra cash too, this app or this website can help you make a little money too, right? Exactly. It could be volunteer or it could be compensation mm -hmm. depending on what the rescue can do. Personally, we, we compensate our fosters, not a lot, but mm -hmm. we certainly don't want them coming out of pocket. And that way, you know, that they can, you know, that they're not, it's not a problem for them. Right. And, uh, you know, it saves us some boarding fees as well. And it's so much better to take a pet out of a traumatic shelter mm -hmm. environment and put them in a loving home than just putting them right into boarding again, which can, yeah. you know, not always help. The most important thing, the only requirement you need is to love pets, right, Allison? Yes. All right. Thank yes. you so much. And you can get more information on Foster Fur Kids. It's on our website. Click, uh, go to kcal9.com. Just click Scene on TV. All right. Thanks.